is supposed to help you get where you need to go and for cheap. But when the bus schedule is less than useful, it doesn't do either. Now one group is going to Newport News City Council asking for change. 13 News Now reporter Nico Clements spoke with the people leading the charge. It's a growing concern for many people in Hampton Roads, including Jacqueline McIntyre. It actually can mess up my employment. McIntyre says there's a lack of service provided by HRT. She's depended on the bus service for five years now, but says the buses aren't reliable. If I was to be at work at 8 and the bus doesn't come until 10, my employer doesn't understand that. They want to know, they want me to be there on time. McIntyre isn't alone. Jay Johnson says sometimes the buses don't come at all. We have a lot of veterans in this area who have actually missed medical appointments that they had months, made months before. McIntyre and Johnson are part of the nonprofit Virginia Organizing. These two women and several more people are voicing their concerns to Newport News City Council tonight. The group says they want buses to run more frequently and HRT to add more routes. They're also highlighting the shortage of bus drivers. Employers are quitting. Right now, HRT officials are working on a project, working on a plan to provide better bus service, but they say they need help from the different cities. The Transit Transformation Project looks at creating a better regional bus system. HRT leaders are advocating for new regional standards, which includes uniform service times, better span of service and more frequent service. However, they say it requires each city to get together with HRT to look at funding Hampton Roads Transit differently. McIntyre says that they won't stop until something changes. We're confident, that's why we're here. It's an issue that matters to not just her, but so many other people across Hampton Roads. In Newport News, Nico Clemens, 13 News Now.